What is up guys? Uh, welcome back to the channel. Um, yeah, it's been a couple of weeks, sorry. Uh, I've been very busy doing this. Um, if you guys are wondering what this is, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I made a post the other day and I said that I got a warehouse for DeathClick. Uh, so it's technically for DeathClick and my printing company, which is DeathClick Printing. Um, but yeah, I'm really fastly ran out of room at home because um, I started doing like digital printing, I do like embroidery, screen printing, stickers, and yeah, there's just too much stuff going on in a little house and I really needed some extra space. So, thank you for focusing. Uh, so what I've done is I've rented a warehouse. Uh, the warehouse is in Calandra West. And uh, yeah, it, this, this is it. I'll do a quick walk around. It's pretty small, so it won't take me very long to do a walk around. But today is move-in day. Um, I started my lease on Monday, and I am yeah just getting everything sorted, uh, and hopefully start working out of here from Monday. Uh, I have to have a tech come to move my digital printer, and which is on Monday morning. But other than that, I should be able to move all of my other stuff before then, and hopefully start working from Monday onwards. Um, so yeah, we'll do like a quick walk around. Start off with someone parked in my spot. So that's fantastic. Front door, tinted. And this is the warehouse area. Um, so I think downstairs is something like 80 square meters. Um, it feels really small because I got all like all this shelving because I need to stack like t-shirts, st just stock everywhere. Um, so yeah, we've got all these racks. Bathroom, shower. Usual stuff, cupboard, light switch. Um, yeah, and then, so that's what it looks like that way. The entrance, my car parked there. Kitchenette, parcels that I've already missed. Uh, and then upstairs we do have an office, which is perfect. Um, yeah, so this is what it looks like from here. So it's pretty spacious, like I should be able to fit all my printing stuff over here, and then maybe cram my car, like my S13 and my 86 in, um, but I'll have to see how I go, because my main concern is actually getting work done every week in here, and then hopefully fitting some cars in on top of that, but we'll see what happens. I think space-wise it should work, because uh, yeah, my screen printing gear doesn't take up that much space, like I've got it at the moment in like half a garage, which is basically like, pretty much, say here worth, which is, Still a lot of room that way. So it should work, but yeah, I don't want to cramp myself. Um, yeah, so we'll go upstairs in the office. This is the best part about the whole thing. It's pretty much why I got it. It has this like epic new upstairs office area. So this all came with it. Yeah, so this I'm going to turn into like my pack-in room. So there's going to be like a table in the middle where I can pack orders. Uh, maybe some like table or maybe those like blocks around the corner so I can stack maybe other stock like stickers and all that stuff that doesn't want to be downstairs in the dirty warehouse. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. Came with this sweet photocopier, which is awesome because I'll use the shit out of that. But I might move it and then I can kind of fit something else in there. Uh, brought the important stuff already, like my skateboard collection. So yeah, up here there is one office. Uh, so this is where I'm going to put my sticker cutter and my sticker printer. And the computers that run those, or the computer that runs those. Um, so it's very cool, it's got its own little room to do all that, so I can chuck shit on, close the door, and I do not have to listen to it. So this is a little, like, sitting area when you come upstairs, and you come upstairs, and then there's this. Probably going to move that into here, and put this couch and coffee table over there, because uh, I feel like that's a way better vibe. Uh, and then back here is my office. Uh, I brought my computer and my printer so far. Um, but yes, yeah, so this is going to be my office in here, so I'm pretty much just going to have my computer, desk, and that's it. So it's going to be a really nice space to be able to do things. Wow, why does my camera keep doing that? That sucks. Um, anyway, yes, it's going to be a really nice space to be able to do things. And yeah. And then I have the view of the complex outside. So very cool. Uh, I'm very excited. It was pretty expensive to get into a place like this. Like, you got to pay like two months rent up front. Oh, two months rent is bond and then like... A month in advance on your rent um, and your rent's paid like monthly uh, and all that kind of stuff and then like all the little shit like getting internet connected and insurance you gotta have insurance that sucks um, but all that sort of stuff so yes very cool uh, and then I can watch the downstairs from the upstairs or I can close the sweet shutters
anyway, I actually get back to bringing more stuff down from the house. Um, so yeah, this is my new workshop shed warehouse thing that I'm going to now be using for all of my death quick related things, which is really crazy because I started the brand like five years ago and I never thought that it'd get to the point where I need to have something like this. So really crazy, really cool. Uh, and I'm, I'm really, really excited. Uh, yeah, anyway, back to the house and keep doing some more trips and then hopefully by the end of this weekend um, I'll have you guys all updated and then we can do the walk around with everything set up and ready to go. Uh, bye. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention the best part about this. Like, basically most of the reason I got it. I don't know if you can see, but upstairs we have fully ducted AC. So... It'll actually be really nice to work out of. <laughs> What's up guys? Uh, it's been a few days, I'm not gonna lie, it's now Tuesday and uh, I, I haven't filmed anything because moving is a lot and a lot of work and it takes ages and I've done so many trips to my house and back to the shop and I'm very glad I got a shop that's only like eight minutes from my house uh, instead of the one that I was looking at which is like 25 minutes from the house. Um, but yeah, so I'm pretty much mostly in here and set up. Uh, I got some screens drying that I reclaimed. I'm going to coat them and I got a, a biggish job to do tomorrow. Uh, I think it's like 100 and maybe 100 shirts, uh, all screen printed, so it's not too bad. Um, last night, though, I did finally find a new screen printing carousel to buy, so that's now this. And uh, yeah, I'm very excited about this. Um, so, my old one is one like that's super old. And yeah, I just really needed to upgrade it. So it has this crappy registration system. Um, so these wheels actually slightly move and it makes for not as amazing prints as they could be. Um, and then it uses wooden boards, which kind of, after a while, they do start getting warped. Um, and yeah, I'm just very sick of that. And while I'm mid-vlog, Max Gorey shows up. Oh, what's going on? This is all... Oh, why would you want to sleep? You have a child. Exactly. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Yeah, do they... Yeah, this is... Max is actually dropping off my car. Yeah, I am. From getting tuned, because I'm too lazy to drive an hour to get it, because I've had a lot on. Um, but anyway, we're going to do car stuff, and then I'll re-update on the shop setup after that, so... That's not too bad. Second start, what up? Yeah. That's sick. Is that foot on the brake? Whoa, what? My brake lights work? That wasn't me. That's hectic. So it's a little bit messy at the moment still with like setting everything up but so we have like carousel down there all the screens up there um shelving with blank t-shirts on it uh shelving with other crap on it uh these are all blank shirts to be printed uh and then we've got my digital printer here more shirts to be printed a little bit of vinyl and uh yeah that's pretty much how everything's kind of set up we'll go up into the office um so i moved the couch over to here uh, photocopies there. I have internet, which is amazing. I haven't set my skateboards up. Uh, so this is like the kind of like the shipping room and the sticker making room. Um, so I'm still in the process of setting up. I think I'm going to put another one of these tables here. So now I've just got like twice as much space to work in. Uh, this is the sticker printing room. Uh, obviously I need a desk for this. Uh, and there's some stickers I ran off today for Desai. Or Dazai, I don't know how to pronounce it. But anyway, I've got a bunch of stickers to do for him. Uh, here's all my vinyl and crap. Um, and then this is my office in here. I've got to sort out all these boxes. And I probably get, you get a little table for there. But I've got my bench in there. Oh, my desk in there. With that. 
computer and uh, yeah my sweet window to look out of and yeah it's kind of where we're at um, but yeah really excited for, about the space and what I'll be able to get done here and achieve here um, and then yeah hopefully I can kind of get to a point where I need an employee and then start making money and moves and yeah that'll be very very cool but anyway I have to finish coding some screens uh, and get home uh, it's pretty late but we'll get the crawler in here and then I'll do a little a little bit of that and then uh, we'll say goodbye until next week um, I might start filming more shop videos um, but yeah because I don't do as much car stuff anymore because I'm really focused on doing all of this um, but yeah I'd really like to start doing a bit more of my life in these videos but uh, thank you for watching and I will uh, see you whenever check out the merchandise oh wait no I'm not wearing any don't check out this merchandise check out this merchandise <laughs> There we go. Corolla parked in the shop. Yes. Very grateful for everyone that's supported Death Click ever, because uh, I definitely would not be here without you. Um, it's uh, it's unbelievable that I could just start this brand five years ago with this idea that people would like drift, drifting related apparel that's not car stuff and just enjoyable designs that I think are cool and. And the people have supported it and we can afford to be in a facility <laughs> it's um it's it's incredibly incredibly insane and uh yeah if you watch the videos and you do support the brand thank you thank you so much um anyway subscribe to the channel check out the merchandise and uh i'll see you guys later